In this presentation, we're going to show you how to adjust the most important Facebook privacy settings. Now, to access them, what you need to do is just move over to the top right hand corner of the screen and go up to the account tab and just click on that. And then, if you move down, the two sections one is the account settings and the other one is the privacy settings. And these are the two areas where you can adjust various different privacy settings within your Facebook account. So, first of all, what we'll do, we'll click on the privacy settings link. We're going to recommend some settings which are common sense middle ground and that will allow you to leverage your community and allow you to be found through your friends. So first of all we'll go over to the section connecting on Facebook and this is the area which determines how people can find you on Facebook and how you can connect with them. So if we just move over to the right and click on this link here view settings. So this first one determines who can find you on Facebook so what we want to do is change that from everyone. So if we click on the Ev everyone button and now we've got an option to change it so we're going to change that to friends of friends. The next one send you friend requests we're going to keep that on everybody. The third one send you messages we're also going to keep that on everyone and the following four we're going to change all those just to friends only. So for this one see your friend list we're going to change that and click on friends only and the same for education and work, your current city and hometown and your activities and connections. Now you you may notice at the top of the screen there's a button here preview my profile. Now that allows you just to go and look at your profile and it'll show you what it looks like to other people so you can hit that button go in and see what it looks like and if you're not happy with things you can come back and change these settings again. Right what we'll do now just go back to the privacy section and now what we're going to look at is the sharing on Facebook section. So these settings control who can see what you share. So if we just scroll down towards the middle then click on customize settings. Now what we're going to recommend here is all of these from post by me right down to places you check into we're going to change all those to friends only. So if we go to the top one and scroll down and click friends only we're going to do that for all of them. And then what we'll do in this section which is include me in people here now after I check in we're going to uncheck that so we're going to disable that and finally on this page we're just going to scroll down and click on the edit privacy settings here and this is going to let you control who can see your profile pictures so at the moment it's on everyone and we'll just click on the button and change it to friends only okay so now we'll go back to the settings so move up to this button and click on that so now what we need to do is just scroll down the page and move on to the section which is headed things others share. So the first section will change is photos and videos that you tagged in. So click on edit settings and you'll see a new box open and there's a button here so click on that and we'll change it from everyone to friends only and then click OK and the permission to comment on your post will change that from everyone to friends only. And this next one if you're happy for your friends to post on your wall then click enable then click on the next button and change that to friends only. And the final one in this section, friends can check me in places, click on edit settings and change that from enabled by clicking this button and select disabled and then click OK. Then finally on this page we're going to look at the contact information and we're going to change that from friends only and here we just want it so that only we can see this information. So what you need to do is go down to the bottom, click on customize then click on this box and select only me and then click save settings and we'll do the same for the last two and then finally the email address let's just click on customize and change that to only me okay so what we need to do now is just scroll back up to the top of the page and then go back to privacy by clicking this button and then we're going to move down to the bottom of the page and look at the apps and websites and there's a link here edit your settings so click on that and what you can do here is delete any apps that you don't need anymore or you don't like so click on edit settings and you can either click on the cross or click on edit settings and then just click on remove app and it'll come up with a warning just say yeah remove and it just confirms that so click OK and then go back to app privacy OK, the next one which is info accessible for your friends, click on edit settings and what you want to do is uncheck all of these options here. So I'll just whisk through that now. OK, and then make sure you click on save changes and just
just confirm that OK. Then moving down to the next one, game and app activity. I'm going to change that from friends of friends to friends only. The next section, instant personalization, which deals with third party websites, we're going to click on edit settings. And there's a video here you can watch if you like. So feel free to watch that. I'm just going to click close to get away from that. And what I'm going to do is uncheck this option to enable instant personalization on partner websites. It's giving you a warning here, are you sure? Click yeah, confirm. And then what we'll do is just go back to apps. We're going to just the final one on this page, which is public search. Click on edit settings. And this section determines whether or not people can find you through Google and the other search engines, even if they're not on Facebook. So what we'd recommend is that you leave this unchecked. So if there is a tick in the box, then just click it to uncheck it. OK, we've adjusted everything in the privacy settings. What we need to do now is look at account security. So go up to the account tab, click on that. Then move down to account settings, click on that. Now on this page you've got various tabs at the top, so make sure you, you're on the settings tab. So if you're not, just click on that. And then we need to go down to the account security section and move over to right and click on change. So what we're going to do here, we're going to check this box here, which will allow you to connect on a secure connection whenever it's possible to reduce the chance of hackers getting into your account. And the other thing we're going to do is just check send me an e email box. So if somebody does log into your account from another computer or mobile device, you'll be notified. OK, so click on Save. Now we want to go up to the top where the tabs are and click on Facebook Ads. So the two sections here, Ads shown by third party, so click on this link. What we're going to do, we're going to click the drop-down box and change that to No One. Click Save Changes. Then we'll just click on this Facebook Ads tab again. And then we'll move down to Ads and Friends and click on the Edit link. And we're going to click this drop down box here and change that to no one. And click Save Changes. OK, well, that's it. So if we just go back to the home page, and just remember if you want to change any of your privacy settings again, just click on the account tab and then go into either the privacy settings, or if you want to change the security of your account, click on account settings. OK, that's the end of the Facebook privacy settings presentation.